Hey, it's the Kids Life fans, and today we're going to have a awesome candy haul, and I got these today. I'm kind of nervous about one in particular one, and it actually has real ghost peppers in it, and I'm very, very nervous, and my mom's going to do it with me, but let's start with the box of boogers. I'm worried, it says Tangy Gummies tangy gummy boogies that feel and look real so let's try these box of boogers and i have my glass of water it tastes bad ew they're kind of big they're way big actually they're really big bigger than boogers but they still Ew, my goodness. Okay, I'm going to try this. Mmm. Mmm, it actually tastes good. That was the yellow one. And the green one. Mmm. These are all good. It kind of tastes like a tropical fruit. They are really good. And now that I know what everyone tastes like, probably these two green ones are my favorite. But this one's actually really good. Now we're going to try by Jelly Belly a pet rat. And it's made out of gummies. I'm kind of grossed out by how it looks like. But I'm sure it's going to be okay. Mm. <sighs> oh. Okay, I just need a moment to describe you what this feels like and what this looks like right now. It looks um, disturbing, very um, disturbing. It has like a squishy everything in the tail is like chewing. So I'm gonna try a bite of its tail. <laughs> the texture. Even half, this isn't half bad. <laughs> I don't like the texture. Now I'm going to try by the same company, Jelly Belly, the Pet Tarantula. And I'm like, the rat didn't seem too bad, but it really was. Like, what did it look like? And I really don't <laughs> touch this. Ew! I don't want to touch this. Ew. It's just a mold. It's just a mold. It just looks really gross. I guess I'm going to try a part of its leg. Mmm. Mmm. Lime, lemon, sour apple. Not, mmm. It's, it's good, but mm, it's kind of gross. I guess I'm going to say this for last, so Let's get on with the sizzling bacon. Sizzling bacon candy. Oh my gosh. these um, they taste um interesting <laughs> now we're going to try a fruity pizza it's gummy candy and this is really cool Pull that. Uh, this looks really good but not in your normal pizza I'm gonna take these pizza slices out. These slices are so adorably cute. And I'm gonna check it back. <laughs> Very chewy. Mmm, these things are good. Very fruity. Save that pizza for later. So, 
Alright, the time has come for me to take my stand. We're gonna try, I'm gonna try, the gummy ghost pepper. Huh? I'm doing this for you, not me. I didn't even bite into it. <laughs> it, this is literally, it wasn't spicy. It just burnt my tongue. I'm not gonna, no thank you. It just smells like cherry because that's the flavor. It burned my tongue. I'm gonna have a sword. Mom took the tiniest bite. Um, I tried to take a big one there, but epic fail. So I'm not sure I'm gonna take another bite of this. You don't know how, right when I bit into this, it was an immediate shock to my tongue, and I would definitely not recommend this, but if you're trying to do a prank, I would probably chop this up and put it in red jelly, and let someone try this, and that would be a great prank, but I would not recommend this to be your dessert of any kind. So let's put that in there for now. I am pleased with everything else. Except for the bacon candy and the yummy ghost pepper. pepper. <laughs> this pepper was so hot. Okay, well my family's gonna try this. They're probably gonna, I'm gonna say, oh, it was so good. And they're probably gonna take a big bite. So I'm just hoping. But I hope you enjoyed this video. I would totally recommend everything but the yummy ghost pepper. Unless you're pulling a prank or if you just really wanna try it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video with all these different kinds of candies. I just want to give a shout out to Jack Sugar Shack. He is in Chattanooga. And I got all of these from there. There's totally so much cool stuff there. And I'm just giving a shout out to him. Um, and I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye.